I've been working for 11 years, Luke. I've had 15,000 jobs. I've saved every dollar I ever made. That and the miracle of compound interest has created a bounty of a quarter of a million dollars. You live here? Yes, I do. I'm supposed to install a DSL for a Lorelei Gilmore, is that you? Yes, that's me. I'm Mick. Hi, Mick. Nice to meet you. Could you get off my porch? I was told that you wouldn't be here but to look for a ceramic frog with a key in it. I don't understand. We can't find the frog. Hey. Where do you want the swans? Um, well, do you know where the pond is? Nope. Okay, do, uh, you know that little road you came up? Nope. Okay, do you know how to say big help in Chinese? Nope. Michelle! I'm the new assistant manager here. Oh, now wait a minute here. I've been sampling food at this establishment for years. The next time you put something in that mouth that doesn't belong there, I'm gonna remove it and then call the police. I'm just doing my job. Stop saying that. Uh, this has to do with flowers we ordered? Flowers we did not order. I'm just doing my job. Say that one more time and I'm going to punch your nose. Attention guests. The buffet line is clogging at Sector B. I repeat, Sector B is moving too slow. No, oh, Kirk, I didn't know you were into photography. It's my passion. Have you ever shot a wedding before? Actually, this would be my first official wedding gig, or photography gig for that matter, but believe me, I've got the eye, and my Nikon is state of the art. Well, I've got a Nikon too. It's an N64 with 3D matrix metering, 35 to 210 zoom. What have you got? It's a Nikon. Why? Do you know what this is? Um, no. Soup with garlands, gay and rosemary. You're gonna stay in character no matter what, huh? Tis hot, so proceed daintily. Hey, did you ever see that I Love Lucy where she goes to Buckingham Palace? Mom. Those ones when she was in Europe, hands down, those were the best. No way, the Hollywood ones. Ha! Ah, damn. Well, I checked under the entire house. And? You have termites. What? Tens of thousands of them. Subterranean, dry wood, the whole gamut. Gross. Four of them crawled up my nose. Um, I forgot my card at home, but I think my number's 6247. You forgot your card? I might have lost it. You lost your card? I might have. Was it temporary or laminated? Laminated. That's a permanent card. You lost a permanent card. I've made a short film that I've been working on for about five years now. Well, uh, what kind of movie is it? Oh, you mean is it blue? No. Perfectly PG. Uh-huh. It's not exactly Babe, it's more like Babe 2. Got it. Same pig, harder edge. That's my home phone number, my pager number, my cell number, and there's a partial list of references. Yeah, okay, I'll hang on to this, but as I said before, we just opened, so I'm not really looking to hire anybody right now. I am licensed to carry a gun, if that will help. Hey. Huh? Cows eat hay. And after some experimentation and a great deal of research, I developed what I believe to be the next great skincare product to sweep the nation. Hey there. A complete line of creams, balms, toning lotions, and cleansing liquids. But I'm sorry, don't cows eat grass? Sometimes, but grass there is a bad name. I have a delivery for Suki. Oh, wow, anything good? No, just some wedding photos. Great, well, she stepped out for a minute, but I'll take him to her. Luke, are you taking applications for jobs at your skateboard and bottle shop? Yeah, I'm interviewing people today, Kirk. Great, shall I go home and change or will casual suffice? I like to go in home part. We have our soda shop, everybody. Yes. <laughs> Meeting dismissed. Taylor, is it too soon to talk about management opportunities? I'll have a piece of pie. Cherry, peach, chocolate, pumpkin, custard. And custard's fine. There's more. I know, but custard's fine. But they made me memorize 30 different flavors. OK, that's 4042. <laughs> I'm also including a few samples. A facial scrub and a honey mask. Very soothing, very healing. It's been mostly her and Kurt arguing about stuff. <laughs> Apparently, he's the director. How about if she says, doll, you've got the gams, but I've got a body in the trunk of my car. Are you ready to rumble? <laughs> now it's going the other way, and they're hitting it between them. Number seven has it. Now number three. Now seven. Three again. Seven. Just one second, please. Aren't you supposed to go through the mail before you get here? Some work that way. Personally, I think it takes the spontaneity out of the job. I'm going to print daily t-shirts featuring a humorous topical headline of something I witness around town. Neat. Babette ate oatmeal. I'm keeping it real. Say, how can I have a career as a poe? It's not a career. This is just an event that we do. I write technical manuals for a living. Yes, but how can I have a career as a poe? So as Kirk's putting the pizza on the rack, the thing collapses, the pizza slips. Long story short, Kirk has got some severe cheese burns. Oh my God, is he all right? No. Uh, who knows? I'm here, folks. Great, Kirk, you find any mold? You mean, did I find any silent death? Not so far, no. Good. I did tell you about the dangers of mold, right? And Ed McMahon's dog? 
Yes, you did. Suffered memory loss due to mold infestation. Forgot how to sit. Hey, Kurt. Bienvenido, Senora Gilmore. I just put that there. <clears throat> Kirk, no. Taylor paid me $20 to jump out of a plane for the grand opening. Strong wind. If you're going to have an alarm, you need it loud. You don't want some crazed, knife-wielding gunman at your throat, and the neighbors are going like, is that a fan? Did I leave the water running? I would like to present you with my new line of one-of-a-kind mailboxes. Wow, they look very nice, Kirk. And whimsical. Get out of the way, Kirk. Hold on, Roger. This car's not stopping. I am planning the Firelight Festival. Taylor left me in charge, and I have to make sure everything's perfect. Move, Roger. What's with all the dogs, Kirk? Well, people in town saw how good I was with Lulu's dog that they asked me to watch theirs for a fee, of course. I offered you the first ride in Kirk's new Star's Hollow Petty Cab, and that is exactly what you're going to get. OK. Time just whizzes by when you're Riding in a pedicab. I did it just like you told me. I personally hid 300 eggs around the town square, but the kids only found 241 of them. Welcome to Mailboxes Etc. How may I help you? I need stamps. Here is our cartoon series. <gasps> hey, do you have any Lucille balls left? Yes, I have some balls. Lady Speed Stick 260. Good choice on that one. Keeps you dry all day and end of the night. Hope ye took much pleasure in Kajagugu. Me thinks Oingo Boingo will soon make us an appearance. All right, well, I've put wood in all the guest rooms and the living room, so all I have to do is store the rest of the cord you bought. Okay, Michelle, I'll take you outside and show you where it goes. Outside? Do you really want to expose your wood to the elements? I took it upon myself to pull the town, and I think you're going to be pretty happy with the results. We are? Jackson is solidly in the lead. Hello? I have a gun! Chill out, Kirk. We're here for the movie. You were supposed to pay out front. You weren't out front. Here's 20. That's too much. Keep the change. Lunch at the Dragonfly. Get your lunch at the Dragonfly. You have not eaten lunch till you've eaten lunch at the Dragonfly. And my new line of bath and shower adhesive decals are for you. Huh. Yesterday, today, and tomorrow. Yesterday's retro designs and today's fashion colors with tomorrow's traction technology. Kirk, what are you doing here? Staff meeting. You don't work here? I thought I might like to go into hotel management someday, and I figured this was a good place to learn. Kirk, what are you doing here? I thought I might want to work on a kitchen staff someday, and I figured this was a good place to learn. That's right, folks. There you go. Thank you, sir. Right in the box, ma'am. Ribbons here, return your ribbons. Your Twickham souvenirs here, Twickham souvenirs. I've got your bats, I've got your balls, I've got your foam fingers. Should we be at all concerned that Kirk's trying to tow us away right now? No. Hey, am I doing this right? What? Never mind. I hear you might be in the market for a ring. Kirk, where'd you get all these rings? I befriend really old women. I'm pleased to inform you that the Stars Hollow Board of Tourism has graciously decided to offer you a proposal. <sighs> More like, look, I'm sitting in a little gazebo. I can see that, Kirk. If you look real quick, you might think it's the regular size gazebo and that I'm a giant. You're aware that this is the first time I'm running the Winter Carnival. I am aware. I can't afford to have anything go wrong. Kirk, I promise this booth will be a big hit. It will not embarrass you, OK? I promise. Your promise means nothing to me. You break them all the time. <gasps> Free chocolate, really? European hot chocolate. It's like mud, but chocolatey. Hello, Kirk. You'll have to wait in line like. Hey, doll. Cheers. Cheers. What are you doing here? Trying to bag a whale. Kirk's in the real estate game now. Stop doing that. What? Referring to yourself as Kirk. But that's Kirk's thing. Every realtor needs a thing. This is Kirk's thing. I could run the place if you want, Luke. Hmm, let me search down to the very depth of my being to see if there's even the slightest inclination that I would want that. Nope. Just checking. Ready for the installation at your say so. No, you can't do this. It's an invasion of privacy. Something to fear, Luke? You can't just take pictures of people for driving by the diner. It's probably not even legal. Spoken like a man with something to hide. Welcome to Kirk's. I'll be right with you. What is this? It's a diner, Luke. A diner called Kirk's? It's the name my mother gave me. Free needles! Free needles! See, who says Stars Hollow is not progressive? You got your stocking plaid, your festive ornament collage, your snowman trio, your peekaboo Santa. Well, it's lovely, Kirk, but I already bought my wrapping paper from the kids from the Stars Hollow Middle School. Well, then you got ripped off. Flower delivery. Oh, Kirk? Oh, I didn't know you worked for Grayson's. 
and the Minotaur. No running in the maze. Oh, and uh, if you get lost in the maze, don't panic. Just stand still, wave your hands, and the uh, maze guard will find you. I will be suspended 20 feet above the street in a clear lucite box with no food or water. In my official capacity as town sash presenter, I would like to present you with this sash, which I also happen to make in my official capacity as town sash maker. I wanted you to be one of the first to know that I've started a new business. It's a rideshare business. I call it Uber. Oh, there's already an Uber, Kirk. No, not Uber. Uber. You're taking the day off of Ubering? I don't know what you're talking about. You know, Uber. The Glogs. Kirk. Next, some of our cuisines didn't show up. So what? You got a good turnout. We advertised an international food festival. All 195 countries represented, and a paltry 15 showed up. Kirk, what happened? But 127 countries never got back to me. Kirk has 43 jobs.